What is it that you are most focused on lobbying for right now? Well, firstly, we are for reform. That's the most important thing. And in my view, the most important thing that we get done for the economy and for the people of this country is a, is a wind-up authority so that we don't have another Lehman-type event. We are all very much of the mind that no one should be too big to fail, but we need a way to wind down a company without it affecting the rest of the economy. Now you've spoken on this before. You say, in essence, you're supporting resolution authority, but you're right. not supporting uh, the putting together, putting aside the funds to pay for it themselves, basically, for right. banks to pay for it themselves. Why not? I mean, isn't that just planning for the worst case? Isn't that part and parcel if the market's already assuming that if a bank needed a bailout, it would get it? Well, the thing is, you got to remember that if you're against too big to fail, this would imply that there are companies that are too big to fail, and let's create a fund for it. Mm -hmm. And my worry would be the government might use it for another purpose. My, my worry also is that the credit markets might actually be doing the wrong thing lending to these banks because they may say, well, you know, maybe we'll never have a problem getting that money back because there's this big fund we can go after afterwards. So I think it could create a lot of bad behavior, and ultimately, I think it would be bad policy for the country. But the assumption, the point's often made that the assumption in the marketplace is that there's a so-called government put option, that there is this assumption that too big to fail or not, the government would step in and help out a failing financial institution. So isn't it just forward thinking to put aside the funds? No, I don't think, I don't think that's a healthy policy. I think if, uh, I'm a believer in capitalism, I'm a believer in Darwinism too. Hmm. If a company screws up and it needs to go, it needs to go. So the government should have the ability to say goodbye to the, uh, to the uh, common equity holders, to the unsecured credit holders, say goodbye to the senior management who got that company into trouble, and you slowly wind it down and sell off the businesses to the healthier companies, just like you would in a broader economy. Why not do that?